صباح الخير جود مورنينج هنتكلم في الفيديو دوت عن الفانكشنز ان بايثونز سو ذيس باور بوينت وي ويل ديسكاس وات ار فانكشنز اند هاو تو بيلد فانكشنز ان بايثونز بيكوز ذير از تو تايبس اوف بايثون اوف فانكشنز بيلت ان فانكشنز اند ذا فانكشنز ويتش وي ار بيلد in the program or during the coding so a function is a block of organized reusable code that is used to perform a single related action another tip functions provide better modularity for the applications means that the application will be uh, consist of more modules or uh, functions instead of all statements or many statements there will be functions and each function is a block of statements the third thing is functions provide a high degree of code reusing so so functions i can reuse this program or use this functions in other applications easily with kobo based function blocks begin with the keyword diff def stands for definition or define followed by the function name the function name okay and parentheses these parentheses the fifth thing is any input parameters or arguments should be placed within these parentheses these parentheses okay we also define parameters inside these parentheses these parameters should be defined the next step the code block within every function starts with the colon after the parentheses there is a colon like the for statement or if statement and is indented the next one the list the statement return expression exists a function optionally passing back an expression to the caller so i have the caller who called the function after defining it the function will return some value to the caller to the statements which called this function and the next one the last one a return statement with no arguments is the same as a return none if the return with no argument so this means i don't return anything this is diagram very good diagram and a very important diagram uh, this is a diff keyword before everything there is diff and this is a function name and this is a parenthesis and inside the parenthesis there is a parameter or a parameters maybe three four five or an array or arrays as parameters and then the statements of the functions after the column and you see the column here and the last of the first is, uh, statement of the function of the first line of the function and there is the statements and the last statement is a return which returns some value or return some variable or return uh, some parameter or expression here also uh, example number one I have here this comment means that this is the definition of the function and here we have the argument or parameters inside these parentheses and this is uh, the diff keyword and this is the name of the function print underscore str and it has one only one parameter which is str1 and these are the parentheses and this is a column and it doing print str1 just print it and return nothing so no return okay when we call this function we call it from the program previously or next so i just write the name of the function without diff as I see here, right, right, print underscore str, 
and I give it some thing in the parameter as a parameter. So I give it calling the user defined function. This will be as to str1 will be printed here. Another thing is about uh, functions. In programming, there are two ways in which arguments can be passed to functions. But by value, functions creates a copy of the variable object in Python, passed to it as an argument. The actual object is not affected. Object is of a mutable type because immutable objects can be modified. Okay. Bath by reference. So the first thing is bath by value. So the actual object is not affected. Well, object is immutable type because immutable objects cannot be modified. While the second thing is passed by reference, the actual object is passed to the called function. All the changes made to the object inside the function affect the, its original value. Object is mutable type as mutable objects can be changed. The past objects are updated. I think it's clear. If there is any question about this, don't hesitate to write me and I will reply you. So passing by value or passing by reference, I think it's clear here. There is another example here. I have the uh, uh, va uh, variable a equals 10 and I started uh, the function by def change value, the name of the function change value and it has only one uh, variable which is a and this is a column and here inside the function a variable a equals 20 then print inside function a the variable a and the address lower address id means the, ID, the address of the variable a and then return here return nothing and then i have this the program i am here uh, outside the function print before function call a and here a will be printed and address id a and the change value here i called the function so i will execute the function here which it's change underscore value and I will pass it a, a variable which is here a equals 10 and print before function again so what's the output the output as here so before I printed a equals 10 and this is the address of the variable a which is outside the function when I call when I call the function I will execute this print statement inside the function which you print a and a here is a equals 20 it's another variable not the same variable it's another variable a here it's the variable inside the function and the address here of the variable inside the function okay and then uh, uh because of this it's its value it's 20 not 10 and it's a address it's another variable then because it's it's like another variable not the same variable a outside the function and then go back and the before uh, function the same statement uh, the same variable outside the function which is a and it's a the same address another example here i use uh, I, I here i passing not the value i not i pass the reference so i pass the here my list and inside my, this my list is an array or a list it's a list so my list item 3 which is force in the force position okay because this was 0 1 2 and this is a place of 3 which has 5 value will be replaced by 30 value so when I print here I will print my list including the new item which will be printed one two four thirty six and the address of my list the same address of this one so and then so print before 
before this will be printed and the same address change value will print the new array after modifying it with the third item and a print after function my list the same which includes the modification of 5 into 30 let's see the output before function call my list one two three four five six address the same address and value inside the function let's see multiply to 35 multiply to 30 and that is the same address and after function call my list one two four thirty six will address the same address there are many examples you can read these examples and understand i will put this uh, link for this powerpoint on the slide share and i will put in the uh, description so you can check it and read it and if, if there is any if there is any question don't hesitate to write and i will write reply for you and answer your question or design or uh, create another video for sponsoring your questions all thank you for watching this video